the velocity of improvement in vision transformer is also astounding. Sang Hyun Hu and colleagues at Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology, Meta and New York University have built Conf Next V2. Conf Next V2 is a convolutional architecture that after pre-training and fine-tuning has achieved state-of-the-art performance on ImageNet. Con Next V2 is an encoder decoder pre trained on 14 million images in ImageNet 22K. For the decoders, the researchers have used a single Con Next convolutional block, and which is made up of three convolutional layers. The authors also have removed layer scale from each Con Next block. In Con Next, this operation learned how much to scale each layer's output, but in Con Next V2, which is the latest version, it really didn't improve the performance. Vision transformers primarily learn from masked pre-training. If you look at their paper, this is the example which they have shown with the decoder experiments. This enables the researcher to learn from unlabeled data, which simplifies amassing large training data sets and thus enables them to produce better embeddings. If mass pre-training works for transformer, it really works for CNN as well. Now, the thing is that the biggest Corp Next V2 model, which is around 659 million parameters, has already achieved 88.9% top one accuracy on ImageNet. The previous state-of-the-art MVI DV2 achieved 88.8% accuracy. So accuracy of Con Next V2 is better than the predecessor. And we already have seen in other papers, which I shared on my channel last week, that transformers are already showing a lot of good improvement in computer vision. But I believe that convolutional architectures can achieve comparable performance with less computation, which is the deal breaker. Also, um, you need, if you don't know what, what ImageNet 22K is, which has been used as a data set for this um, research, ImageNet 22K is one of the largest publicly available image data set, and all the vision transformers benefit from training on proprietary data sets that are much, much larger. So I believe that this is going into the right direction, and um, I'm really waiting for the next v V3 maybe or V4 as where this vision transformers will be heading to. If you have any questions or if you already know about it, please share them in the comments. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you.